What up, though, Heist Man? The foe talk that talk, ghetto news and opinions, man. Devontae Adams, brother, you gotta learn how to control your emotions. Y'all know what I'm talking about, man. The Raiders, they keep raidering. You know how the Raiders do, they lose games. But that ain't what we talking about right now, man. We talking about last night on Monday Night Football at the end of the game. Devontae Adams and Hunter Renfro, they got into a collision and they lost the game. That's what they do. But what happened after the game really got to me, man, because, yo, this dude, he was walking off the field, Devontae Adams, and he just walked up to a random cameraman, like, just going in the tunnel or something, coming out, and he straight pushed that man. I'm talking about push that man straight to the ground. I'm talking about, yo, this 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 dude's skinny. This dude, a little cameraman. I'm talking about this a nerd probably. I don't know, man. I don't know this dude. I ain't trying to put that on him, man. But, yo, he claimed he got hurt, too. And what he going to do? They said he did. They said he called the police on him. You know, he filed him a report, you know, and, yo, when he go to court, if I was him, I'd play it all the way up, man. I'm talking about, look, I'm going out, head wrap, neck brace. Oh, I'm hurt, I'm hurt. For the simple fact, this man is a millionaire. And this man getting paid all this money, man. What it all boils down to, he was just flat out wrong for that, man. He didn't have to do that man like that. It kind of reminds me of, um, this a dirty move. Like, what's my man's name? Patrick Beverly. When Patrick Beverly, when he pushed Chris Paul in the back like this, this is the dirtiest move I ever seen because that man had his back turned, walking away. He just, <laughs> pushed that man whole soul out of his body, man. Look like something from um Doctor Strange. They fly out the body. Some I don't know, man. But yo, Devontae Adams, you ain't had to do that man like that, yo. Um, I, I guess a suspension's coming, a suspension coming for this man. They talking about one game suspension, all this stuff. I don't think that fit. I think he should be done for the year, maybe. Because that, that man, like, he ain't got nothing to do with football. I mean, he the cameraman. He ain't got nothing to do with, like, that's like attacking a fan, basically. That man, like, got a job to do, and he came to do his job, and you're out there pushing, putting your hands on people because you lost the game. Push a teammate or something, yo. Go in the locker room, punch the cooler, do all kind of wild stuff, man. Do that. But um, that to that cameraman, yo, that's, that's, that's wild, man. You need to be reprimanded for that. You need to get everything that's going to happen to you because of that. It's your mistake. You got to live with it. You did it. I know you're probably sorry now because, you know, you know that was wrong. But, yeah, we definitely going to be talking about this Friday right on this channel because I go live every Friday talking about stuff just like this. You just got to come through and highlight me, man. Hit that like button, the comment button, the share button, the subscribe button, the notification bell. All them good buttons you got to hit to get this pimper that I'm putting out when I put it out. And like I said, I go live every Friday at 9 p.m. right here on this channel. Come through, join the conversation. Tell me how you feel about this in the comment section. And holla at your boy. Heist man the folk. Talk that talk. Ghetto news and opinions. Peace.